2010 Turkey Bowl was a great showing for the Warriors as well. On the strength of three second half defensive touchdowns, HD defeated Dunbar 44-12 to secure the first three-peat in school history. Senior defensive end D. John Wilson led the way with a pick six and three, yes, three sacks as the Warriors literally ran away with the football game. I caught up with two members of that 2010 H.D. Woodson team. Let's take a look at what they had to say. Joining me right now to talk about that 2010 Turkey Bowl and securing the first three-peat in school history are H.D. Woodson's head coach, Greg Fuller, and former free safety, Ann Jackson. Fellas, appreciate you guys for joining me so much. Thanks, appreciate y'all, man. Without further ado, let's get right into it. So, of course, only second to the success of your young men in life and of course academically. Um, Coach Fuller, one thing that I've heard you mention on numerous occasions was that you wanted to continue the success that Coach Bob had started here at H.D. Woodson. So to, 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 to capture that first three feet of school history, what did that mean to you as a coach? Well, it really meant a lot for me as a coach because of the type of players we've had and also for Woodson's program that's been long standing since Bob Hedden has been here. So it meant a great deal to me that we could do that for Coach Hedden as well as H.D. Woodson football program. For sure, for sure. Now, when we look back at that game, and Coach Fuller, you and I were talking uh, just before we got started, the play that everybody probably talks about and remembers is your 86 yard interception turn, man. Now, one thing I've always wanted to ask you since that game, and we talked about it briefly while we signed up the interview. Walk us through, man, from the snap, or for real, let's even go back. To the play, to the to the huddle and the play call, all the way to the end of that play when you're celebrating with the team. Just tell us about that whole play, what's going through your head and everything. Okay, well, first of all, um, definitely, that final one is that you see, so of course, back to the side and that's what we're doing. They did a lot of stop routes and everything like that, and um, we sent the blitz on the right side. I'm trying to see the set my flex and that. And I had, you know, I pretty much my, I knew the, they had Olu, one of the fastest in, yeah. the, in the league at the time, so I knew one second I looked back, you know, the same part was on, but uh, I kept it going, and that was that. In the end zone, seeing Shiraz, Shrugs, and everybody, and in the crowd, and the first thing, once I got to the end zone, I looked, and I was just like, this is amazing, you know, that was a selling point right there. Actually, um, I, I think I'm supposed to kick that play the next play. Didn't I? <laughs> <laughs> I, uh, I, decided I missed the extra point, man. That was just an awesome experience. Yeah. I never forget it. And Coach Fuller, you said one thing uh, while we were talking before. That was kind of the play that broke that game open right there. So just such a memorable moment and, and just so glad that it was uh, one thing everybody remembers. 